all right folks so today saturday i have a game just in about an hour's time i've just arrived and it's quite good because i've got someone coming out to watch me an inspector and vigilator a referee coach i guess is the word that they that those guys like to use so we will see what his feedback is and it's beneficial to get somebody to feedback on your performance things that you could improve on things that you should cut out your game um all of those things uh so i'll share with you after the game and yeah it'll be some good feedback i'm looking forward to it cheers all right guys let me give you an update of the game how it went first of all it was a really good game really huge pitch it was massive so it was a really good run out and i had the inspector or the referee coach giving me some great advice okay so i'm going to give you it now i've written it down here on a piece of paper so for a ref a couple of things is uh to make sure that mind we've got no linesman here so you have to be able to make the up and down the park and cover the offside position so it's like it's like a figure of eight that they, they recommend us to do that figure of eight won't mean anything to you guys if um you're not in any kind of refereeing circles but it basically means you make it from end to end from the 18 yard box to the other 18 yard box not just running in a straight line you kind of run in like a diagonal it's like just imagine a figure of eight um figure on the on the pitch so it's a diagonal you have to make these diagonals all the time so i need to do a bit more of that um other things he said here were yeah when there's a throw in or a goal kick or anything like that you get to gauge where the ball's going to land you have to be there you have to be there that's where the incident's going to happen all right make sure you're at the drop zone all right where the ball's going to land i need to get more sprints in i'm doing too much jogging into positions i need to be sprinting more so it's not like a fitness like just jogging it's like sprints more sprints okay to get into position um substitutes i need to take better care of how i'm doing substitutes and the amateur level with no linesman no fourth official subs have this tendency to kind of come on the park when they cannot come on the park until the sub is off and the reason for that is imagine a substitute was coming off the park and just as he's coming off he i don't know abuses somebody punches somebody in the face something like that then he would have to be he would have to be sent off then and then the substitute couldn't come on so it's basically just to so it's clear who's on the park who's off the park okay and then the last one here was descent clamp down on descent now i thought i was quite harsh already with my descent but clearly i'm not harsh enough as in if somebody is just constantly yapping away at your ear giving you descent in a way it could just be nagging at your ear for 70 minutes you know you talk to him talk to them again maybe then have to give them a yellow card then get him and the captain together and say listen this guy is like constant constant i'm going to send them off if it continues then you have to send them off so i think i wasn't as ruthful with that because there was guys there that were just talking 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 like nagging basically and guess what can you tell if they were winning or losing if they were nagging it means they were losing yeah they were losing the score ended like 6-1 uh, so obviously it was the losing team that were just doing all the nagging and moaning and ref everything's going against us the whole victim mentality thing yes so i just need to be a bit more cutthroat with the descent and just clamp down on it so yeah yeah it was really good i will take this on to my next game i will go train get some more sprints in and start and continue to kind of run more in the in the evenings more on the treadmill but not just a half an hour jog or 45 minute jog that's no good i need to do like 20 sprints that's probably more beneficial for a referee than just to jog for an hour um so yeah hope that helps and i will be um doing this every game i've got every single game i'll be giving you guys some feedback on it okay hope that helps cheers